we are at one of my favorite places, Lock Bar in River Oaks District. And quite honestly, I feel like I'm at home because I am belly up to the bar. That's right. <laughs> With my new friend Ryan here at Lock Bar. Thanks for inviting me over. You're welcome, Courtney. Glad to have you here. This spread looks amazing. I love this because we have a fantastic spread, but we're not pairing this food with wine. We're pairing it with... A little bit of whiskey. So rye is that spicy. It's, it's got a spicy characteristic to it. So for me, thinking that idea, cheese and meats. Okay. It was where I went with it. All right. And so personally, the rye, the blue cheese, pulling those together. Just, it reminds me of winter. Oh, absolutely. You know, absolutely. it kind of has that warming effect to it. The nice. color is beautiful. Again, I am not a whiskey or bourbon drinker. My husband is, so I think this, this activity is quite uh, educational. <clears throat> Then we move into the next one, which is oysters. Okay. Oysters, light, delicate. Mm -hmm. So what I've done with this is being oysters from the ocean, Jefferson's Reserve makes a voyage at sea. So literally the way they take this, they barrel it, they put it on a container ship, and it travels around the, around the sea. It crosses the equator four different times. It's just a beautiful, beautiful bottle. This one's totally different than the first one. Complete different world. So this is going to have the corn to it, so not as much rye, so it gets that smooth. Very smooth. So corn actually adds the sweetness to it as well. Now this is the fun part. OK. Take a little bit of the, the bourbon, pour a little bit into the oyster. Really? Just a small little touch of it. OK. Just a touch there. Wow. Briny, but yet smooth. I can taste. That is fantastic. It complements beautifully. It really does. So Weller has always been a big personal favorite of mine. And so I had the opportunity to choose a, a Weller barrel. And so they've just released their full proof. It's 114 proof. And this one is a lock bar exclusive. Even though you're going to have a really high alcohol content with 114, it's going to be a little bit of a pop there. But it's just smooth and it's sweet. Wow, that's nice. It is beautiful. Really nice. I, I do love my weather. I mean, so I love the fact that, you know, <laughs> we're in Houston and we're pairing this with fried chicken. Fried chicken. I feel like I've died and gone to heaven. Now, we can't leave without talking about your cookies and oh, for dessert, absolutely. right? Absolutely. <laughs> so it's our log bar chocolate chip cookies, a little bit of salt to them, but just absolutely amazing. And I finished off with a little Japanese. Okay. The Yamazaki 12, it is so smooth, it is so beautiful. Like caramel, there's honey, there's just different notes of flavor to it. So when you pair it with a chocolate chip cookie, the chocolate, all of it together, it just, it melts in your mouth. There's a touch of peat to it. Wow. It's beauty. It's a match made in heaven, I have to say. <laughs> You all have three exclusive labels, and now we're in COVID. And the only place that you can get those three labels, of course, is here at Lock Bar. But we have a chance to take this at home, right? Absolutely. So we have we have come up with our Lock Bar Elixir Kit. If for everything that ails you. <laughs> well, that's perfect. I hope everybody stops in. In the meantime, Ryan, cheers to you. Thank you Absolutely. for a lovely pairing. Appreciate it. My pleasure. I mean, it's a tough job, you know? Someone had to figure this whole whiskey <laughs> bourbon thing out. It was really fantastic. I learned a lot. That elixir kit with those three exclusive uh, labels, only available at Lock Bar. You can go in and order it or take those three bottles home. You get a chocolate chip cookie because you have to serve it with food here in Texas. Oh, yeah. And a, um, a, a, a glass, the glass that we were using. It was a beautiful glass. Beautiful. A hundred bucks. It's a great gift. For all of those bottles. For all of them. See, I've heard all about the Japanese whiskey. I have yet to try it. And with a cookie, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Match made in heaven, people. Yeah, rough assignment. Thanks, Courtney. You're welcome. Now I just want a drink. <laughs>